it was just a few, just two weeks before he passed. I'm so scared that I'm gonna pull up his text and then accidentally delete it one day. Like it scares me so much because I don't ever want to lose this. Candace Cameron Bure tears up sharing her last text messages from Bob Saget. During an interview with today's Hoda Kotb, the actress reveals she had a small spat with the late comedian. We were gonna have dinner and we got into a little tiff and his flight was delayed. We ended up not having dinner, but in, in Bob fashion, the next day he wrote me like what would be pages long of a text. He was apologizing, saying he was cranky and he was just so he was just so sorry. Thankfully, Candace says they resolved it quickly. And Bob's final message? Well, it was full of love. He said at the end, I love you more for the trouble you're giving me, if that's even possible. And I wrote back, I love you. I could never be mad at you. Roll my eyes at you? Yes, but never mad. When you care about somebody, uh, especially now I'm finding, you, you gotta let them know. Candace, who played Bob's on-screen daughter, DJ, on Full House, also touches on a side of the comedian fans rarely saw. He was so emotionally available all the time. And he was really the first person in my life as a man that I saw um, cry and, and have those emotions right at the forefront of his conversations. If you were hurting, he would hurt with you. You would see the tears well up in his eyes. But ultimately, the mother of three says she's still having difficulty processing everything. I can't believe he's gone forever. I just can't. I, my, my brain has not comprehended that yet. You know, I think for, for even TV viewers, again, you might think like, oh, he, he played your dad on TV, but Bob was so much more than that. You're the best. Oh, I am, aren't I? <laughs> Bob's death has had an impact on the entire Full House cast, including John Stamos. Since the stand-up comic died on January 9th, John has been paying tribute to his late pal, sharing fond memories like this. But he's keeping the humor alive, posting this cute video of his son, Billy. This is funny. The grandfathered star explains in the caption, Billy was never interested in Full House and I was perfectly fine with that. Bob died, now he's obsessed. I blame Bob. The last four years we started to become close. The uh, last four years. Of the eight year run of the, right. of yeah. the first one. And, and then since then, we literally uh, are brothers. The cast of the 90s sitcom came together for Bob's private memorial last month. John and Candace went, so did Jody Sweeten, Mary Kate and Ashley Olsen, Lori Lachlan, and Dave Coulier. Made you a ham sandwich. Dave, Dave, here's my sweet friend Dave. Dave plays Joey on the show, pretty much so, eats all the time. Most of the cast, including Bob, reunited for the revival series Fuller House in 2016. When the show came to an end in 2020, all Bob could feel was gratitude. You know, it's it's emotional, yeah. and we love each other, and we've been friends all these years, and we've been there for each other, and people have heard all this ad nauseum, mm -hmm. but it's it's honestly true. I mean, yeah. it's, a, it's an extended family.